this class will work out some problem on designing of heating element problem 1 a 40 kilowatts single phase 220 volts resistance oven employs circular nichrome wire for its heating element if the wire temperature is not to exceed 1127 degree centigrade and the temperature of the charge is to be 427 degree centigrade calculate the size and the length of the wire required assume emissivity is equal to 0.9 radiation efficiency is equal to 0.6 and resistivity of the wire is equal to 1.09 into 10 power minus 6 ohm meter what would be the temperature of wire when the charge is cold in this problem the given data are input power is given 40 kilowatt resistance oven supply voltage is 40 volts and the wire is circular resistivity of the wire nichrome is 1.09 into 10 power minus 6 ohm meter t1 is given 1127 degree centigrade t2 is given 420 degree centigrade emissivity is given 0.9 and radiation efficiency is equal to 0.6 and we have to convert the degree centigrade to kelvin plus 273 t1 is equal to 400 Kelvin, T2 is equal to 700 Kelvin. Simply the formula H. H is equal to 5.72 into K into E into T1 by 100 to the power of 4 minus T2 by 100 to the power of 4 is equal to 1 lakh 243 watt per square. And we know the formula R is equal to V square by P. Here the voltage is given. 220 is the whole square divided by 40 into 10 power 3 that is equal to 1.210 ohms 1.0 ohms is equal to rho L by A because R is equal to rho L by A where A is the cross-sectional area we can write A is equal to pi D square by 4 or pi R square 0.01 resistivity is given and we, know, we don't know the value of L if simply say the formula L by R square is equal to 3.486 into 10 power 6 now under thermal equilibrium condition input power is equal to h into surface area surface area of the circular wire is equal to 2 pi r into l substitute in the formula we will get r into l is equal to 0.057 i got two equations by solving these two equations i found l is equal to 2.31 meters and r is equal to 2.53 mm d is equal to 5.06 mm the second part is what would be the temperature of wire when charge is cold when charge is cold at 25 degrees centigrade t2 is equal to 73 plus 25 is equal to 218 already we found h 1 lakh 11243 substitute in the equation we have we don't know the value of t1 we know t2 by solving the equation we found t1 is equal to 1378 Kelvin or 1105 degree centigrade. The second problem is a 10 kilowatts 220 volts resistance oven is employed nickel chrome strip thickness of 0.025 centimeter. If the wire temperature is not to exceed 1200 degree centigrade and the temperature charge is to be 600 degree centigrade calculate the width of the strip assume radiating efficiency is equal to 0.6 emissivity is equal to 0.9 and resistivity of the wire rho is equal to 1.03 into 10 power minus 6 ohm meter in this problem the input power is given 10 kilowatts operating voltage is 220 volts single phase resistance oven nickel chrome strip Thickness of the strip is equal to 0.025 cm. T1 is equal to 1200 degrees centigrade. T2 is equal to 600 degrees centigrade. Radiating efficiency is equal to 0.6. Emissivity is equal to 0.9. And resistivity of nickel chrome is equal to 1.03 into 10 power minus 6 ohm meter. Now T1 is equal to 1200 plus 273 is equal to 1473 Kelvin. Similarly T2 is equal to 600 plus 273 is equal to 873 Kelvin. 
we know that h is equal to 5.72 into k into e into t1 by 100 to the power of 4 minus t2 by 100 to the power of 4 substitute all the values in this equation h is equal to 1,39,129.69 watt per meter square R is equal to V square by P V is operating voltage is given P is given R is equal to 4.84 ohms R is equal to rho L by A A is a cross-sectional area that is a strip therefore cross-sectional area is equal to W into T Therefore, 4.84 is equal to 1.03 into 10 power minus 6 into L divided by W into 0.025 into 10 power minus 2 or L by W is equal to 1,171.91 that is the equation 1. Next is, we know that under thermal equilibrium condition, input power is equal to H in the surface area, surface area is equal to 2 into W into L, it's a rectangular strip. Substitute all the values, we will get W into L is equal to 0.036. I got two equations, one is L by W is equal to 1171.91 and W into L is equal to 0.036, two equations. By solving these two equations, I can find the length and width. Here, length is equal to 6.44 meters and width of the strip is equal to 5.5 mm. Calculate a yeah, 50 kilowatts, 3 phase, 400 volts resistance woven is to employ nickel chrome strip 0.025 cm thickness for the three phase torque connected heating element if the wire temperature is to be 1000 degree centigrade and that of charge is to be 627 degree centigrade calculate a suitable width of the strip and assume radiating efficiency is equal to 0 0.6 and emissivity as 0 0.9 the specific resistance of nickel chrome alloy is 1.03 into 10 power minus 6 ohm meter. In this problem, the input power is given 50 kilowatt, 3 phase, 400 volts, resistance woven, nickel chrome strip. Thickness of the strip is given 0.025 centimeters, 3 phase, torque connected, and T1 is 1000 degree centigrade. So, T1 plus 273, that is 1000 plus 273 is equal to 1273 Kelvin. Similarly, T2 is equal to 627, 627 plus 273 is equal to 900 Kelvin. Power per phase is equal to 50 into 10 power 3 divided by 3 is equal to 16,666 watts. Phase voltage is equal to 400 by root 3, that is equal to 230 volts. R is equal to V square by P. That is phase voltage the square, 230 the whole square by 50 into 10 power 3. That is equal to 3.172 ohms. R is equal to rho L by A, where A is a cross sectional area. A is equal to W into T. 3.172 is equal to 1.03 into 10 power minus 6 into L divided by W into thickness 0.025 into 10 power minus 2. L by W is equal to 770.39 equation 1. The next is under thermal equilibrium condition input power P is equal to H into surface area. Surface area of the strip is equal to 2 into W into L. H is equal to 5.72 into 0.06 into 0.9 and substitute T1 value T2 value the H value is equal to 60,849.80 watt per meter square 16849.8 into 2 into w into l is equal to input power 50 into 10 power 3 here w into l is equal to 0 0.137 this is the second equation by solving these two 1 and 2 i will get l is equal to 10.28 meters that is the length of the wire is equal to 10.28 meters Width of the strip is equal to 13.33 mm.
Thank you.